What's up, everybody? Welcome back. This is Final Hydra. Today, we are continuing our adventures into Elden Ring. And what what are, what are we doing? I, I have no idea. Uh, We're going to figure out something to do. I just don't know what we've... Okay. Oh, oh, I remember. I remember. We just came upon this sad scene over here of a... Oh, God. Did he leave already? I've actually never come back to this location after the grieving father, like, mourns his do he just leaves her she's dead jim that lady's definitely dead oh god I'm disrespecting a corpse jesus uh all right so we came down to the weeping peninsula we were gonna look around and uh try to level up a little bit maybe or just explore i'm not a hundred percent sure where my thoughts are on what we're doing but we're gonna do something then maybe we'll go up to old Stormvale Castle. I don't know. The world is our oyster, folks. We can do whatever we want. Nobody can stop us. We're all the way up. So let's just start. We're right here. We're going to go this way. We're going to... Just like that, all right? We're going to go all around. We're going to find some stuff. I'm going to stab that sheep in particular. Oh, God. The FPS drops there were atrocious. Did you see those? That was terrifying. I hated it. First, let's let's pick this up. Yellow ember, mine. Rats with glowing eyes, I hate them. All right, don't worry. Oh, we got him. Oh, we got him. Now, these rats here. Now, these rats right here. You see them? You see them? Look at them. Look at them. These rats right here. They be afflicted with the flame of frenzy. Or, uh, I actually don't know if it's actually called the Flame of Frenzy when it's, uh, you know, afflicting just random rats and such. It might be. But we're about to find out. Oh, he's got, we have the same spear. Look at us go. I find that a little peculiar, don't you guys? That we have the same spear? It's like Patches was from here. Maybe they'll recognize me as one of their own. Oh God, just rats. I really wish that uh, that descending heavy attack there was enough to take out the rat. Okay, that one, it one tap. Ho! Holla baloo! What? Oh God. All right, what are we? What are we gonna do to this guy? Oh, he didn't give a crap. I was really hoping that that was gonna do a little more damage. Yeah, yeah. Huh. Yeah, yeah. Got him. All right, easy. Easy. Now we come in here. And we can get the flame of frenzy, which we will not be using. I will not be I will not be going down that dark path. If you wanted to see me use the flame of frenzy and go down that dark and mysterious hole that that really does lead you down. You should watch my live stream, because we did that on there. An incantation originating from the maddening three fingers causes the yellow flame of frenzy to burst forth from the caster's eyes. The flame of frenzy deals damage and causes buildup of madness, which is basically like another status effect uh, that will damage your HP and your, uh, your FP pool, which I think is really interesting because it's like really good against like players. And things that actually have an FP pool, which is, I think, literally just players. But not... It, it's not bad against AI. But it you don't really get the full effect of it, you know? You know what I'm saying? You, you, are you picking up what I'm putting down? I hope you are. Because I'm saying it pretty plainly, I think. I think. So we're going to take that, that little shield. Because uh, I don't even think it's a good shield, if I'm being honest. But we're going to take it, okay? All right. As long as we're all on the same page. Oh, I remember where we are now. Took me a hot second, but now I remember. And I do not remember how to get down. There. Hmm. We will figure it out. Or my name isn't Rumplebumpskin. Here we go. All right, we figured it out. It would actually be a very silly character name. Rumple Bumpskin, here he goes, riding his horse. Yeehaw. That's just like a 
Oh, that's a demi human. I, I thought that was one of those like masses of flesh and garbage on the ground there. No offense, no offense. And then this little lead back this way. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. There's a site of grace over here. I don't think I've ever gotten this site of grace on any of my like numerous characters. Which makes me wonder what else is over here that I've never gotten. What what have I ignored? Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. There's the site of grace up there. Holy crap, this is like just right here. This is so weird. I, I can't believe I've I've literally never dealt with this at all. There's a tower here. I've never been in this. There's a There's a body here. We're gonna loot that. Alright, all the guards seem to be waking up. Okay, we're gonna right up here under this second floor and we're gonna climb like our little butt depends on it, because it just it very well might. This guy's throwing things at me, you hear that? What is this dude shooting at? What are you bombarding? Are you literally hurting like those three demi human that are just like down there clutching their heads in fear? My gosh. A hand ballista. We will not be using that, probably. But, uh, it sounds powerful. You know? Like, it sounds like if you got hit with it, you would be sad. My god, look at them. They're just down there covering their heads. They weren't even, like, running. This guy was a monster. <laughs> Let's get down there and go kill them now. Because he was also really bad at aiming. Well, looks like he killed at least a couple of them. Be stronger or die. Either rise up to the challenge of that man in the tower, or you wait for a man to come by and stab you on his horse. Like, it's one or the other. You can't have both. You need to be strong for yourself. What is this? Examine. All right, well, he didn't like me very much. Apparently, he disappeared. Oh, there he goes, taking a walk. He's taking a walk on the wild side. Oh, what the hell's down here, I wonder, quietly. And by quietly, I mean out loud. And by out loud, I mean there's a whole chest right there that I can see currently with my eye holes. Hit that quick little catnap there. Uh, the floor looks a little distinct right in front there. I see those cracks. Like, that's pretty obvious, I think. I got a pickled turtle neck out of it. All right. Oh, no! I... Okay, well, we got the treasure, which was trash anyway. Oh, there's a rat. He doesn't care that I'm stabbing him. I find that rude. Ha! My perfect rat weapon. I really thought it would do more, but hey, it did do... It, it killed one of the three, which is... And then it froze these ones in fear. They just watched the Rat King die. They weren't ready for this. None of them were showing up today thinking that their king would be felled like that. All right. All right, Rat Ratto. this way another drop oh my legs I'll just pick up all these bugs what could go wrong this is a large cavern oh can I summon in here I can oh I feel like I'm gonna need to got me yeah that was uh he was a little rude not gonna lie i probably should have tried to summon before he started getting up
Ho! All right, Mr. Bear. Let's see what kind of damage we can do. That does not really do a lot, does it? Yeah. Yeah. This is doing damage, but not really as much as I would have hoped for. Oh, we staggered him. We staggered him. Oh, I've got my back to the wall. My runes are on the ground. I still haven't picked up my runes. Jesus. The demi-humans are doing a fantastic... Oh, boy. They're doing a great job of drawing his attention, which is really all I can ask for. Oh, boy, I am out of... Uh, I'm out of mana. Oh, that was it. That was all I had. Oh, he's done. How does it feel to be done for? Booyah. Let's go. Let me get that sweet stuff you got hiding in your lair, Mr. Bear. Took it all. It's all for me. <laughs> all right. That was cool. I've actually never been in that cave before. Five other, five other characters. Never been in this one. What a time. All right. Let's get out of here. This cave sucks doesn't but we've already cleared it like it's got nothing else for me you're weak cave you're weak sauce all right back on our adventures oh is there something here i forgot to get up oh, some rainbow stones always good always good pick up some of those if we ever do any uh kind of co-op or pvp always nice to have more demi humans everywhere this is the, the this is like the demi human like conclave over here. Jeez, do they live in these ruins? I wonder quietly out loud. Demi human forest ru ruins. Yeah, this is like theirs. Ho! Oh! Hello, sir. I'm here to talk to you about your extended warranty. Oh, that does some decent damage. Oh, you also cast spells? You're fun. This is really not doing that much, honestly. Like, it seems like it was doing a lot, didn't it? I hope this does more. Oh, that definitely does more. I stole your leaf. If that's what you were protecting, I took it. Don't you even worry. All right, we're just gonna, we're just gonna pace. Oh, we got him. We got him. I like that he's got, like, magic. It kind of feels cool. Like, you know, he's, like, the smartest demi-human to ever human. Oh, and we got some cool spells out of it. Yeah, you hit me a few times. You don't get to walk away. The rest of you bow down to me. Bow to me. We also got a staff out of that. We have a... What is this? The demi hu Oh, that was... Excuse me, your majesty. I didn't realize. I'm so sorry. We got the Demi-Human Queen staff. It's got a better sorcery scaling than what we currently have. Maybe that becomes our stick for a while. Does this have anything? Uh, any bonuses? Catalyst for casting sorceries? Nothing really. So we're gonna use... Oh, I like it. It looks like a, like a scepter. Ha 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 ha. You know, we should probably read about that thing and actually find out what the hell it is while I laugh while carrying it, right? Oh, gotta come up here. I'll take it. Oh, the faith not crystal tear. I bet that's going to raise my faith if while I use my wondrous physic. Physic. 
That is really nice that that's a one shot on those guys. We are killing it out here in the Weeping Peninsula today, boys. Going higher and higher. Here we go. This here probably is a site of grace. I mean, look at it. It's a church. There's always sites of grace in there. No. No. You don't get to call anybody. This guy's not even looking the right way. Jeez. At least this guy's turning around for it. You know, he's prepping for the for the eventual stabbing that's to come. Oh, there's a dead guy just chilling there. Da 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 da! Another secret tier. We just got two of those. That's not bad. Let's make our flasks better. I think we could also level up, too. Ooh, we can. So where are we at? We got 16 decks. Our intelligence. Do we? Was I trying to use the twin blade? What was I doing with this guy? Endurance. Mind is still only at 17. Vigor is at 15, which is good. I think last time we played, we raised our vigor a bunch, which is good. That's all good. Glintstone stars. Slicer. Feels a little weird using like that when... Oh, maybe this is good. That's only 14 FP. Verse 4, 14. So it's the same FP as the stars. The glint blade does seem to do more damage than like everything, though. It's kind of rough, but maybe we maybe we leave. Oh, oh, oh. We have to increase the amount. We have two sacred tears to use there. Do I have another one? Okay, just making sure. Do we have any golden seeds? Not enough. Okay, good. How are we looking? Four, three, and three, I think. Uh, wondrous Physic. We get health, and we get some stamina. And, yeah, I think, I think we're good to keep persevering here. Now, we should probably upgrade this staff. I mean, our other staff was a plus one. This one is not a plus one because, believe it or not, I found it on the ground and it was not plus one. Now we can either keep going this way. We've got the walking mausoleum out there. Those are super cool because they, they allow you to uh, duplicate uh, boss remembrances, which you get for beating like big main storyline bosses, which I always think is like really cool of like a of a concept like because i i always hated that in the other souls games where it's like ah you've got the remembrance of wh whatever his name was and uh you can pick one of these four really really cool weapons and it's like well, what if i wanted more this sucks nerd like it's like all right well f me i guess I saw you I saw you turn and I learned from the bear. I'm not waiting for the health bar to appear. All right, I should have maybe done a little bit better on that. Oh god, they're getting destroyed. Oh god. My 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 men. Oh god, my horse. Oh my god, it's a goddamn tragedy out here. Are you just walking through my crap? Oh! Yeah, I mean, that is decent damage, I will say. You can do your little butt slam. You're just going to get stabbed in the butt. I think it's so weird casting these spells and then just watching them do like this this very oh gosh that very delayed hit that they have it's 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 interesting what the hell is this oh oh no you'll never get me with that i'm much too intelligent oh but the old slap me with your stick that gets me every time Oh, 
I'm a fool. Please just die. Wouldn't it be so fun if you just freaking died? Just like that. Thank you. Thank you for being a good sport. You only made me sing it at you. Loser. Don't tell him I said that, okay? He'll get really mad. So we got the opaline bubble tear and the crimson burst bubble tear, all right? I'm game. I'll take it. Oh, I was gonna say, I hear you. I hear you back here, hanging around. Hell yeah, give me that life back. What the hell is this singing? I hear it. I hear this singing. Simmer down there, you scary bat things. Are you singing? Oh, it was, it was this. Oh, ow. Oh, good. You could sing and make poison. Two things I would definitely associate with one another. I'm not confused at all by what your character's entire thing is. There's a lot of these bats here, I realize now. I'm just gonna leave. I never picked up the item. Well, there's now two less bats, so it's like slightly less sliver of meat. That's not what I thought my reward would have been for killing bats and a singing bat. That's not it at all. Alright, let's continue the way we were. Nothing up there, right? I don't think there is. There's one way to find out. We gotta, gotta do a little parkour. Oh, I could have just... All right, let's not talk about it, all right? All right, thank you. What are you guys doing over here? You lighting fires? Don't play with matches, kids. Always keep a bucket of water and a fire watch handy or something, you know? You, know? you don't want to burn down the whole neighborhood because you thought it was fun to burn matches and throw them at, at dried out leaves. So, let's have a look at... Oh, there's enemies nearby. Everybody's upset. And all I did was give some good fire tips on how to not burn down the damn neighborhood. And they're all upset. I got some... Oh, I got some pants. So, we are here. We've still got more over here to do. Let's go boop. 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 Just like that. All right, we've got three waypoints. Let's hit them, a oh, baby. A oh, dun dun dun. Oh, wait a minute! I almost forgot. Yeah, I for almost forgot there was a tome right here. I believe it's a catacomb. Are you a catacomb? I am correct. <laughs> I didn't I didn't know where I was going with the end of that one, but I was correct. All right, let's let's best this. Man, is it going to be worth it? Probably not. Do we all know that? Yeah, it's going to suck whatever it is. I think it would be really funny if they'd included one in the game that Okay. Yeah. Oh, God, a cookbook. I think they should have included one in the game where you use a stone sword key to go in, and then all the loot inside is just one more. So it's literally just, it's worthless to go in. Like, you don't gain anything. You don't lose anything. It's just, like, there. Because <laughs> I, I can see people getting really upset about it. And that's just kind of comical to me. All right, now we are going to figure out how to get up. Oh, it's this way. Whoopsie. Yeah, yes, my weapon is very bad against these gentlemen. That is why. Oh, this is, that is why this is where we die. I'm going to guess right now the fire is going to end. Our only hope. 
Oh god, is that the fire kills them and keeps them dead. Jeez, I literally couldn't do anything. He just kept staggering me. I couldn't roll. I couldn't do anything. Holy hell. Oh, we've got enough. Is it? No, it's not 6,000 to level up again. Is it? Wait, no, it definitely is because we killed the stupid. God dang it. I hate forgetting that I have runes on me. I'm really bad at remembering it personally. All right, so we go this way. And then we go up here. Okay, and then we go up here. And then we go, whew, and we go zoom, and we go, ah, and then we run through this little side hallway. I'm tired. Hold on. All right, now we run. Nope. I'm trying to, I'm trying. Ugh, I'll stagger you to death this time, buddy. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. First try. Oh, please stop whatever you're doing. It's a stab. Okay. I see what we have to do. Hold on. We gotta grab that. We gotta grab that. Oh, thank you. Thank you. No, please don't touch me. No. Why did it go up? We jumped on it. That usually works. <laughs> and then they were hitting it and me, and it still wasn't going up. Oh boy. Nothing like looking at looking incompetent real real fast. Here we go. We go zoom. We go pachow. We go zing. And now we go this way a little bit. All right, we're going to time this perfectly. Here we go. Here we go. We're going to get there in the fire. Oh, no, the fire's not on anymore. We don't got to time it. We just got to go. <laughs> See, jumping on at that time worked immediately. Everyone's going to be like, hey, you jumped on it uh, gently before. Or something stupid. Can't wait to read it in the comments down below on how I jumped incorrectly. Should have jumped with more of my toes and less with my heels or something. And now, the boss is ours. <laughs> he will be nothing. He will be nothing beneath our heels. I don't even... I honestly don't even remember what, who the boss is here. It's underneath one of the... The Ur trees. Is it one of the cats? One of the cat monsters? Nah, I ain't playing that game. Get the boys out. Boys? Defend daddy. Uh, he can teleport. Uh, red alert, red alert. Shoot him. Shoot him with the lasers. Fire everything. There we go. Easy. First try. I was never in any danger. That was all sim that was simulated fear. We had that. We had that in the bag. All right. He's clip. Let's go back to the front. Get all our stuff. Remember, if you use the teleporter that's in there, it will not refill your flasks, your health, anything. If you just teleport back to the front, which is going to do the same thing anyway, it will refill it. All right. We have some places to go. But let's check out what we got back there. Where is Luffle? 
Oh, I want to read more of this. Glintstone staff styled as a scepter, a gift once given to the demi-humans to foster peace. It can be wielded even by those of low intelligence. Sneered at by fools at the academy. What does this need? 30 strength. Oh, boy. Perfect for reckless acts such as storming a castle. Oh, my gosh. We're not doing that. We're not that reckless. Where's my spirit? Uh, there they are. Okay, so we have... We have Ingval, who's 100 FP, and now we have Luffle the Headless. Lutel? 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 What do we got? Uh, Spirit of a Headless Knight, who's who leads the Mausoleum Soldiers, wields a, a lance enrobed in death and hurls spectral lances at foes. Luthal sacrificed her life so that in death she could continue to protect a soulless demigod until their revival, earning her the hero's honor of Erd Tree Burial. Oh, it's also a lady. It's a lady knight. She's got a, she's got a spear that's wreathed in death. I mean, she sounds like literally a, an absolute badass, and I'm, she's got my respect. I'm going to summon the hell out of her, but we got to get our mind up a little bit more. All right, what do we got here? Tombsward Ruins. Okay. Hey, rat, what's the deal here? I got a liver. What's down here? Uh, I don't know who you think you are just running at me like that. Unacceptable. Oh, I see you. Huh. Good thing your projectiles are slow and stupid. Oh. <laughs> Never in any danger. It was just simulated danger. Right, what do we got? The winged scythe? Yeah, that's not a fake wall. Bunch of liars. Let's have a look at that damn thing. Well, we can go to equipment and look at it. Oh, oh, a faith. Sacred scythe resembling a pair of white wings deals holy damage. Hmm. According to pagan belief, white wing maidens are said to be death's gentle envoys. Well, there's that. Alright, let's... Oh, we've got another ever jail here. Alright. All right. More of these little wormy dudes. And there's the walking uh, mausoleum. Ding-a-ling. Uh, do I have any more of these? I do have one just for this. Let's do it. Oh, God. I have reduced health and reduced uh, FP. But I'm like, yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Ever, ever jail time. Every time I say it like ever jail, I think of the old Adult Swim Super Jail. I don't know if anybody else watched that madness when it was on or if that was just something I, I subjected myself to. But it's like always weird. It's just the thing I remember. All right. Well, we do decent damage. With our... Oh, she's taking a knee. This this might be the time. Okay, that's really cool. That... Not so cool. Ow. Got him. Uh, uh, never mind. Not dead yet. No. I should have. I should have healed. I. I understand that. Okay. Oh my God! I've got nine thousand goddamn runes. Why don't I ever level up? It's like, dude, this is not. This is not good. This this is too tough. The game at least is like, alright, get out of here, punk. Alright, 
Here we go. Oh! Nope, that's the wrong... That's the wrong animation. That's the one. Dump everything. That is such a cool move. I want to do it. Huh. You won't catch me with that. Oh, but you will with that. That that will hurt me. Oh boy. All right, yeah, you hit really hard, uh, person. Oh, we're getting you close. Are you scared? You should be scared of me. Yeah. Get, get, get out of here. Get out of my face. Yeah. We'll check that out in two seconds. All right. I think that was another talisman. Ooh, that might be pretty good. Radagon Scar Seal. An eye engraved with an Elden Rune, said to be the seal of King Consort Radagon. Raises vigor, endurance, strength, and dexterity, but also increases damage taken. The seals, the seals represent the lifelong duty of those chosen by the gods. Uh. What's it giving me? It gives plus three to everything. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna use that. Like plus three to the everything? Yeah, I think uh, I feel like that's gonna be worth it, guys. I don't know why I feel that way. I know, crazy concept. I only slightly missed. All right, let's not talk about it. He's dead now. You can't hurt me anymore. Come on. Yes, I knew the horse could do it. All right, so we did get... So we went there. We went here. We've now just got our third waypoint up here to hit. Oh, I see them. Gah, gah. Oh, he blocked. Hey, I just got uh, a, a named lady who's also headless, so... I'm just saying, guys. You know, you could maybe just die. Another sacred tier. So now we have to upgrade the flasks. Uh, again, that is three sacred tiers that are just down here in the Weeping Peninsula. If you, if you need to upgrade your flasks and you haven't come down here already, you should. Oh, wait, we did get new wondrous physics, and I have to level up. What am I doing? Gosh. This one here, uh, this here restores HP over time, which I kind of like, and this negates damage. Um, yeah, why not? Well, oh, God, I gotta level up. Please, please stop being stupid. There we go, one in each. And we're actually close to a third level. Holy cold cow. Still should probably go back to the round table hole. That way we can raise that demi-human staff up. I think this guy's like long club spear, whatever it is, so cool. I don't think like you can get it from killing them. I hope I'm, oh boy. Oh, he's launching space. 
He's making it rain space. Yeah, he just seems to make it rain all around him. Wow, he has a lot of health. Like, just... Just for reference, I am literally stabbing these dudes up a plenty. And they don't even care. And like, they're going down. Two stabs, done. Him? Undetermined amount of stabs needed to take him down. I'm poisoned. And that makes me sad. Uh, we should probably rest here to cure the poison that's coursing through us. Oh, we've got a little merchant man. Hello. Oh, it's been an age since I've seen a customer. How can I help you? What do you sell? Oh, we definitely need a lantern. Like 100% we need a lantern. I do not need a two-handed sword on this guy. Like that, that literally serves zero purpose. Smithing stone level two. Now that might be useful to us. I'm not 100% sure. Let's go back to the round table. Raise up that staff a little bit, shall we? Shall we? I said, shall we? Bump, 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 bump. Well, I took you, man, man, to lay out your own. All right. If we raise this up, it will go. See, this is like B to B, but this is already getting more of a. Yeah, it goes to 134 to 136. Then, oh, look, now we can get it to uh, B intelligence scaling. That's pretty good. I don't know how stupid it is to keep raising that up, though. Like, I, I don't know if that's, like, a dumb idea. Oh, and now we actually can use the Twin Blade. It is... It is kind of... A cool idea. As a dex weapon. I'm not sure. We also have the Whip. Which I don't actually have any desire to use, but it does always sound enticing and fun. But we did raise the staff up. That's the important bit. All right. Let's see. Now, we did the heartbroken maiden. We we have to do a little bit more for her to get her involved. All right. I think I'm ready for this fight in here. Let's give it a try. If you were like, whoa, what are you talking about, Hydra? You're in the round table. There's no fighting in the round table. Well, in here, it's a little different. Mag Tongue Albridge. I'm never going to bow for you. I like how that, that staggers, and it looks like it leaves like a... Like, I want to say it feels like I could potentially get behind him from the stagger and maybe get a backstab off. I'm not sure. All right. Ow. Oh, I ran right into that. Oh, interesting blood thorns. Eee. Okay, frostbite is not what we want right now. Uh, he got me on that. I'll give him that one. Oh. Oh, God. Dang it, he just knows. We came in here doing very well, and now we are... 
doing a little less than well. He's, he's does a lot of damage with that scythe, I will say. He's very scary, very scary. Important bit. I like taking screenshots. You never know when a good one comes up and it might be a thumbnail. This guy might be the thumbnail for this episode. Who knows? I think he's probably getting ready to flask. Right there. Damn, I was trying to delay him. Yeah, he's got reach, but so do I. Oh, that was a little embarrassing, that miss. Like, man, we had him. That was a pretty good block for us. That wasn't. Don't worry, I just need some more magic for you, and then you're done, Albert. Oh, he's totally done for. He can't dodge all that. He could never. He could never dodge all this. <laughs> Get out of here. Hit him with the old clam slam. Now, the taunter's tongue there is a... It's an item that you can use to make yourself more invadable basically like so when players are just trying to do like blind invades it kind of makes you more susceptible to them which is whatever it's not that crazy well, let's head back up to good old storm hill shack She's still waiting for us to go in and save or to give the chrysalids a message for her. Yeah, ugh, it's pretty rough. Okay, so the last thing for this little bitty bit, I think let's go see if we can't get ourselves a... I mean, the spear is nice, but we need to kind of get a weapon that is going to carry us a little bit further into the game, if you know what I mean. So let's work on getting ourselves a intelligence-based weapon, because as much as this stabby stick is nice, it's not exactly the best. And I'm trying to think like, oh, what should we do? We could definitely push into Stormvale, but... I think what we could do instead, there is an area up here that I do not know if it's really going to come down to if my spells can hit hard or not. Do I know if they'll hit hard enough? I'm not 100% sure, but we're going to give it a try and see how it goes. All right. And when we get up here to the front, I'll show you the map. Don't worry. But you can always just follow along and oh, or you can or we can get hit by crippling lag. Should be right up ahead here, I believe. I cannot believe that he tracked that well with that. I'll, I'll just be honest. I thought he was just going to roll by and completely miss us. I, I would have bet the house on that. <laughs> All right, where did I already miss it? Am I a big old dumb, dumb dummy? I might be. 
I very well might be a big old dumb dumb dummy, and I may or may not have just killed myself. I did just kill myself. That's fine. That's fine. That's okay. I'm a big dumb dummy dumb 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 dumb. Alrighty, I found it. Here it is. Let's look at our maps. Oh, he's still up there yelling, isn't he? All right, we're going to come inside, and then I'll look at my map. Man, he's really upset up there, isn't he? Okay. It's called the Gale Tunnel, but it lets in right here. This is where we just were, okay? So you can mark that on your maps if you would like to get here quicker. Now. We can go to our Lost Grace. And we've got good old Alexander here to talk to. I hadn't expected to see your face again. Are you heading to the Festival of Combat too? Oh, no need to be coy with me. Judging by the fine wallop you gave the old backside earlier, I would venture you're something of a warrior yourself. The mere thought of such a festival gets the blood pumping, eh? According to my calculations, passing through this road should lead us to the Kalid Wilds. But, however you slice it, it seems we've reached a dead end. I'm sorry to have raised your hopes. It seems my calculations must have been off. I, would many great warriors reside within me, ever dreaming of becoming a great champion. It's my destiny. And the reason for which I quest, it is my ordeal, you could say. To test myself, to better myself, to fell ever greater foes. And then, one day, we'll be a single great champion. The greatest of all. What do you think, eh? How do you rate my chances? For you, very high, Alexander. I was many... Okay. We seem to have reached a dead end, he said. Is this door locked? It doesn't open from this side. Son of a gun. I thought it did. 
All right. Well, I think it's funny because then it'll even tell you where the tunnel connects to on the other side. So you can just go there, which not a bad idea, but that does seem to let's go up. We'll go down and we'll go into those tunnels just for you folks. Well, it might take a little while. We're going to go pick up a couple weapons, and then we'll kind of figure out what we like and what we don't like about them. But our goal will be to find a couple decent weapons that we can use with our intelligence, and then kind of just go from there. I'm going to take those. Give me that. Give me that. Because I do like this spear, but it is... It's pretty okay. Yeah, those... Those things are absolutely monstrous, let me tell you. I'm terrified of them, and I don't like them. But this is the Kalid Wilds, as Alexander was just speaking about. Oh, God, you're still alive. It is incredibly brutal out here. The enemies hit very hard. Most of the time, they will attack in groups like this i just wanted to see like what our damage looked like hitting them with our weapon and it does not look very good oh god there's a lot of dogs here these things will kill me very quickly if given the chance i was really hoping we were going to do more damage to that thing one more perfect Oh, I forgot what it was. We, cool. Good enough. We got the item. We're gone. We are g -g 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 gone because this area will... It, it's not good. It will beat you up, spit you out, and then make you ask for it a second time. It doesn't even... It, it's, it, it, it doesn't even care if you say please. It just it beats you up again. Now, please tell me I still have one more of these. Okay, good. If I got here and I didn't have one, that would have been a little embarrassing to me. If I remember correctly, this is the Sword of St. Trina. Now, silver sword carried by clerics of St. Trina inflicts sleep ailment upon foes. St. Trina is an enigmatic figure. Some say she is a commonly... Uh, is a commonly young girl others are sure he is a boy the only certainty is that their appearance was as sudden as their disappearance and it comes with the mist of slumber ability which can put things to sleep very interesting in my opinion very cool ow okay This thing is like the, honestly the worst right now. Like you could tell I'm trying to leave. You don't gotta be like this. Oh my God. You nasty, you nasty and you know it. You're a monster. Get away from me. Let's just touch the bonfire here or the the lost grace and we'll just wait for the Oh, it gave up. Oh, the dog is fighting it. Or they're fighting something over there. God knows what. It it didn't look good. Let me just let me just put it frankly. It did not look good. Oh, we've got another one of these little guys running around. I didn't know if the if the uh if the sleepy mist stayed for a while, that was my test. I'm gonna chill here. Oh, I felt it past this rock, and then I was like, I feel like I'm going to swing a little too slow. We'll give it one more. One more pass, because this is a bit of a long one. Let's get ourselves ready. Yeah, this is this this little uh Guy has a really long route. 
You gotta be kidding me. What? How? Do I have anything that's got like wide sweeps? No! No, I was in the menu. God, I'm a fool. Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm ready. There we go. Flames of Red Bane. Something we will not use. That's where we want to go. Okay. Take that, loser. Tee hee hee. At least I think I yes. Uh did I just mark this castle like a like a nincompoop? I think I did. That's the the castle is not where we want to go. Dang, there's another sword out here that I'm trying. Oh, that could just stop. That could stop. Wow we I think it's down there. Alright. We're getting a little bit long here, guys, but I want to show you guys this weapon if I can get to it for us. Because it's pretty damn cool, in my opinion. And I want to show you all about it. What are y'all doing down here, huh? Huh? You having a good time? Not anymore, you're not. <laughs> I love just hitting them and running. They just get the hell out of there, boy. Oh. Yes, all right. Now we are headed in the right direction. I think. Yep. Yep. I'm not even beginning to get, begin to talk about these things, okay? Or the weird enemies in this area. Please just, just understand that they are absolutely disgusting to me. I hate them. I don't even like looking at them. Not that guy. That guy's fine. He's he's just weird. I'm gonna find this. I'm trying to find that. There the stairs are. I... Now this is gonna be a quick in and out maneuver. Stay low. Stay low. They've noticed us. Shields are down. Huh. 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 We've got the meteor blade. We can run. Yeah, yeah. Dodged. Dodged. We've got it. And now we fly because we do not want to be here anymore. This area is hella gross, but we do have to help Alexander out. So that will be our next stop. All right, have we gotten far enough? Excellent. Why do I not trust that? Why do I feel like I... No. Okay, did I actually come in here and... I did not touch this site of grace, did I? I don't think I did. Okay. Anyway, we did just get the the meteoric ore blade. Katana forged from meteoric ore to dispatch life forms born of falling stars. Deals magic damage. The blade is weighty, known to deliver slashes of such ferocity that the impact is said to resemble the crashing of a falling meteor. Super cool. Super cool. And probably what we are going to use for a little bit. It's a little heavy, though, isn't it? It is a little heavy. That does 140 plus 50. Yeah, this does better. So we'll use this. And, if I'm not mistaken, does also cause blood... Uh, bleed build up oh that's not what I wanted at all
Enemies in this area are going to be... I'm not going to call them out of our league because that's not correct, but I, I really can't stress this enough how bad the Kalid Wilds are or, like, how brutal some of these enemies in this area are. They're just... They're tough. They're tough as nails, and they don't give a crap if you're ready or not. And that's just this area. Like, I would probably never come... Oh, see? We just got two tapped. Two tapped. This area is a little tough, to say the least. So, we came here because I want to go through this cave to open up that door for Alexander's quest. Also, the boss does drop a cool weapon. But we might be in a little over our head for this level. Um, God. And falling down here like this is honestly the worst way to go about every part of this area. Because then he does that. That automatically wakes everybody in the area up. It's just bad. These dudes here, being miners, are resistant to anything. That actually looked like my spell killed me. <laughs> All right. What we are going to do is probably grab my souls, and we are going to skedaddle for a little bit. We'll come back to this area at another time, especially now that I have the Sight of Grace. That was, like, the big thing. I wanted to grab the Gravitas, not the Gravitas, or the the Meteor Blade. It does have, uh, I think that's actually what its ability is called, though. That. I don't know. We might be able to get through here. I'm not sure. I'm willing to give it at least a little bit of a try. One more try. One more, and then we'll call it Squaresies. Because I don't think the tunnel system here is... is very intricate but I don't think I want to get lost in doing this for 52 years either I love these guys like examining that thing like they have no idea what the hell it is these guys have never seen a land octopus before, and they hope to never see one again. And that land octopus is coming on over because he wants to be friends. Now, I also am trying to consider, like, is pierce damage, like, better for this cave versus other things? Potentially. Very potentially. All right, I see the big... I see the old biggin. That was kind of like the big thing to grab in here, so. Honestly, he can he can slap around in here all he wants. He can keep everything else. He can, him and his babies can have that area. I don't want it. All right? All right. As long as we've all established what I do and don't want, which is everything in that spot. That's all for him. Oh, boy. We might just, you know what? I was going to say, I think he's going to hit me. Should have just did the roll. Whoa! I think we should just go open that door for Alexander and call it, call it, call it a good time, you know? Because look, it's right here. It, Like I said, this cave system is not super intricate to get through. It's just super intricate if you're going to go through for all the resources. Because uh, there are other levels in there that you can go to. Um, to get more resources, more mining material, and stuff like this. Boop. Smithing stones. See, this is a good spot for smithing stones, I believe. And does this side? This side does have the site of grace as well. That's weird. I don't remember getting the other site of grace. I think this site just counts for both. Are, is that enough to level us up to? So close, it's, it's honestly a little scary how close that is. Now... We should be done. This should be 100% the end of this episode, but because I have no self-control. All 
I want to see how we do against this guy. Like, this dude absolutely, positively might destroy us. And I know that. Yep, I rolled right into the... Oh, yeah. Yeah, and he's just... Oh, he's melting the demis. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. We've got crispy fried demi human on a stick. Who who wants a who wants a plate? Everybody come on down. Get your plates ready for the barbecue cuz it, it's not looking good. <laughs> uh what do we actually have in FP? We have 93. We're so close to these guys, but All right. Let's do that. Go this way. Ignore him completely for a hot second. It's so weird that he's doing that uh, run dump lava bit because I thought he didn't do it if you were close enough to him to. Uh, so like, cause that's kind of like his, uh, his mid to long range ability. I'm pretty sure. Now he's going to do the sword slam. We are dealing like chip damage. I wouldn't say I'm, I'm happy with how much we're doing, but let me put it like this. I think we could do. Oh, we got the stagger. I, I would don't, don't mind me. Maybe if I just aim all these at his head, that'll help. We're just gonna keep dodging, all right. I've kinda used up all of that. So we can get him to about half health just using our magic and nothing else. I'm willing to give this a try now. It sucks that most of our range is required to get him to half health. And that's kind of like our safety net stuff, too. Okay, that, that blocked a lot of his damage. Oh, and we get the knockdown again. Let's go. Come on, big guy. Oh, that did so much. Did that do that much the first time? Oh, no, that was probably the bleed proc. Because remember, now I have a katana, it's dealing bleed buildup as well, which is important because, you know, that's damage. It's a lot of damage, too. It, it can do a lot. Oof. That was almost a one-shot from him. Good for him. Good job, buddy. That was a nice attack. All right, you're just going to stomp around. I feel a little like, like maybe, all right, you're going to do that again? Going for two? All right. I'll just walk if you're gonna if you're gonna be like that and you're gonna make this area hard for me to, to fight you in, then I'm just gonna walk. And then, you know, we'll wait for you to, to stop being a grumpy gills and we'll get back to the fight. Alright, Mr. Wor worm? Magma worm. I jumped into that so bad that was like if I lost the fight right there, that would have been my own fault, you know? Hey, take a picture. Smile for the camera, buddy. Oh, that's a nice, that's a good one. I like it with him with the lava in his mouth. Hey, buddy, you want to take another picture? Want another one? Come on. Oh, oh I think that might be better. If you're just going to do this, we're going to keep taking pictures of you, okay? All right, Mr. Grumpy Gills.
Now sit down, good sir, all right? Calm down. There was no need to be like that. Thank you for the picture. And now we get the other sword that I wanted to find for us, which is the Moon Veil. Oh, we don't have enough intelligence yet. We'll get there, though. We're, we're not far off. I think we're, what, one away? Cool, let's just have a look at it. So the Moon Veil is going to have C intelligence scaling, where this has D. Uh, obviously, it kind of looks like the Moon Veil is the bigger, better brother of the of the ore blade. But uh, honestly, we might use these together. Uh, these might this, these may be our two swords depending on you know what we're facing And we might be doing something like this who knows because they they're gonna have a lot of magic damage We're gonna have blood bleed uh, Bleed build up which is super good can like damage that you can like I'm not gonna say you can rely on it, but you kind of can um, We do have enough to level up so let's level up get that one intellect we need so that we can have a uh, I could show you the other big thing with the moon veil, all right? All right, come on. Let's show it off. Let's show it off. So the moon veil also, you can enter the transient moonlit stance, and then you can go, whoa, or, oh, hold on, sorry. I have to resheath it. Whoa, how cool is that? Am I right? All right, and then this one here, obviously we have this, which will pull everybody in, and then... Do anything else? And then you could do that chop? No, that's just a normal R2. Really? That's all you do? Oops, took it off. Uh Gravity Well, in addition to dealing damage, his attack pulls enemies in. Alright, well. I mean now we we actually have the stats to dual wield these, so. How bad is I'm technically a heavy load right now? But that is 100% just due to uh, my helmet. Oh, this also does weigh a little bit more than uh, than things did prior, which is okay. We'll be all right. We'll figure out which one we're going to use a little bit more of, and then we'll probably wield that for a bit until we can get our endurance up a little higher. 14 is incredibly low. So, but... For now, guys, I think this is going to be the end of this episode. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed this. We got a lot done. We got a lot of cool stuff. Uh, I hope you guys are still enjoying the series. If you did, please leave a like. I always appreciate it. If you like this content and you haven't already, please consider subscribing. That would also be super dope of you. And as always, if you're looking for more live gaming content, please check out my Twitch channel. The link is down below. Thanks, everybody. This has been Final Hydra, and I will see you all next time.